Wagwan, bienvenida, que bola, e friend, welcome black, black is for expansion, for our subconscious minds. For those of you who are new, I am a real journey in these social media streets. On my channel, I like to break down the energetic connection between the physical and the non-physical realm by tapping into what? Tapping into our divine feminine chaotic souls so you can receive the most healthiest, uplifting self-love message of peace that we have surrounding us today and happy tuesday um june 18th for those of you all let me see what what is today yeah tuesday june 18th <laughs> so let's get into this message so today i heard the message i heard was chosen ones said peace be still today i heard that we are being not only uprooted, but we are being rooted at the same time into new forms of mentalities, self-protection by using our emotions. Um, I'm hearing that some of us, those of us who are chosen, you know, those of us who are the black sheep of the family, you know, whatever you, it is that you set out to do that is so different from whatever you've done before, because it's not necessarily like you're the black sheep of your family, but more so you're the black sheep of the generational family inheritance that you that you have received in this lifetime that's pretty much what i'm saying not really like you physically like the people that you are physically related to in this realm and at this time frame of your life that you are connected to physically but more so the generational family inheritance you're breaking curses because you are paying more attention to your emotional mindsets meaning what your emotions are actually saying to you as opposed to just paying attention to the masculine part of it all meaning just paying attention to how your emotions make you feel you know and you're just going with that you know just kind of like um a toddler growing up spiritual wise you know like your spirit is growing your empress energy is growing your divine femininity meaning your emotional bodies is growing in physical form meaning you are being more spiritually enlightened you're becoming more spiritually attuned which is how and why you're now saying peace be still you know because now you're in more emotionally intelligent I'm hearing, I'm hearing today is bringing a lot, um, bringing in a lot more courage for those of you who have been following the path of your own courageousness, just you initiating yourself to step out of your quote unquote norm, the box you put yourself into, you stop doing that. And which is why you're starting to feel more um stability it might not have hit your life physically yet but it has hit your life mentally and emotionally why because you told peace to be still i'm seeing people walking that fine line of balance that it takes and you only get that through being emotionally intelligent you know, emotionally conscious, emotionally aware, it's being, even if you're a masculine, don't you remember, this is energy that I'm reading, being a queen of your queendom of swords. That's the message. That's the bloodline lineages that's coming down today. That is the emotional inheritance that many of us are about to become an emperor of if you catch my vibes you know because emperor energy is all about you understanding not just the um emotional aspects of yourself but also the mental aspects of yourself and that thin line that we have to walk to understand it you know that combination of how our thought processes um how our thinking abilities i should say 
how we process through our thoughts and the emotional um i'm hearing the emotional connections that it takes as well as the mental connection it takes i'm hearing the word gratitude like your higher self is thankful you know that you stuck to that thin line that you went through all those quote unquote curses that was thrown at you, but you overcame all of that just so that way you can have that time and ability to be able to say, peace be still. So I'm seeing a lot of things balancing out and I'm seeing pinnacles, like pinnacles falling everywhere. You know, I'm seeing a lot of, of new experiences coming in for a lot of us because of the simple fact that you told peace to be still that's the message that i have for you today friend just a friendly reminder you are a soul that is here having a human experience therefore with the most high through your highest self understanding of what life is and what should be for yourself so just remember as always you are the first creator and the only creator of your life and you are the only one that can create the peace in your life so stay blessed in your peace bye